Hi, right, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy, the Daughter Ash Revolution. Smash the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, like and share this video, leave comments down below. And I will have some links to my videos according to the response that I've been getting lately. We want to talk about, ladies and gentlemen, the truth about the diamond program that drivers don't want you to know. You're like, wow, why we got to go there with it? We're going to go there with it because they went there with it. We're going to first start with these diamond orders here in the community post. I talked about which was about three days ago. This is a review for dollars per mile ratio. All right, I showed my I show my acceptance rate. I show my ratings, which is right there. I showed it on that video on that uh community post tab right there. And then I show the orders and that was $25 and tw $25 and uh, 25 cent for the hour so I go in the comment section you know I you know I go back I look at the comment section you know to go back and interact with drivers respond to the comments and stuff like that I talked about diamonds are available in a market near you check out the dollars per mile on these diamond orders we have Jeff here that made his comments and the no tip no trip movement and the decline now movement people that gravitate to, to, towards those movements don't want to let them go they die hard. They're real die hard fans of those movements. Reddit groups, the Reddit social club group, and the Facebook social club group. You know, they 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 very aggressive behavior and attacks and assaults that they put on drivers that speak against what they what their beliefs are about how you should run this business or don't agree with how you should run this business let's start with jeff s and his response is show all the screenshots of buttercup go to laugh and want to troll but the real truth is he butt hurt i told him to use a calculator you too lazy to use a calculator to figure out what the dollars per mile ratio is. The dollar per order and the dollar per hour. You too lazy to use a calculator to, to, to use your mathematics to see the truth that's in the community post. We did live streams, ladies and gentlemen different than any content creator out there okay the live streams that we did was we showed the details in our ride-alongs the ups and downs the struggles the low offers the high offers the best offers the worst offers the slow hours the best hours during lunch rush breakfast rush dinner rush and we kept collecting them diamonds they butt hurt. Then I hear a video just today. And I told, you know, I tried to talk to Reese. He wanted to go on there. He, he told me to check, check out the live. And I didn't feel comfortable wanting to look at it. Plus, I needed to make my money. I didn't have time to preoccupy, uh, preoccupy my time. Losing money while they on their live streams 
unless they get ready to pay me $35 an hour to be a participant of their live stream. Other than that, it's going to be a lot of live streams. Action that's going on is going to be irrelevant to the DoorDash revolution. And reason why it's irrelevant to the DoorDash revolution because of my experience of what I have witnessed with my eyes, ears, and the things that's going on in my environment. Let's go back here and we're going to talk a little bit about what this man said. And I went and, and I responded. He said, I don't need one referred to all screenshots, not, not just the good ones. Okay, fair enough. Now, here's my debate. Tell those content creators that shows all the lowball offers and not the good ones. Tell them they like to cherry pick their content and go into the worst areas and all they show is all these bad offers and not tell you the truth that other drivers are pitching these orders, catfishing these orders. All right. And dumping orders and holding on to these orders till they see drivers and then they pitch it to that driver so they can get better offers. But they claiming they the best delivery drivers out here making that money. Fifteen hundred a week, three hundred dollars a day, fifteen ten to fifteen hours to make three hundred dollars. Then you are on multiple apps too. On top of that. And it's still taking you 10 to 15 hours to make $300. Something wrong with that picture, ladies and gentlemen. If I got to run five to 10 apps per day just to make $1,500 a week, five days a week, and it takes me 10 to 15 hours to make $300, something is wrong with that picture. That means that I'm not doing something right. That means that I'm making money, but I'm not maximizing my earnings and making a profit. That's what it means. It means that I'm throwing more money away than I'm making. That's what it means. They don't want you to know the truth, ladies and gentlemen, that they butt hurt because the DoorDash revolution not only talked the talk, but walked the walk and did it in a live stream that you can't argue against. Live, live it in color. Yeah, I know they be lurking. So they thought that they would ambush the DoorDash revolution by saying, okay, let's get, let's, let's see, can we real recent? See, the, whatever difference that talk and real talk with Roy have has nothing to do with me. But somehow, some diabolical person thought they was being a genius, was trying to seize the opportunity to want to go to war on a live stream with the DoorDash Revolution when I done told them. I'm not finna waste my time. For me to go on them live streams, you're going to have to pay me $35 an hour just to show up. And that ain't no bribe. Because when you do that, I'm not showing up anyway. That means that I'm not going to waste my time with irrelevant nonsense. Now, let's go back to this guy here. Let's go back to him. The truth they don't want you to know about the diamond program. Not once have I advocated the Prop 22. Not once have I taught any information on the Prop 22, you idiot. Because I'm in a state that don't have Prop 22. If I'm making money off of these diamond orders, and I know how to do it dollars per mile, dollars per hour, hmm, dollars per order, which your driver Mike talked about years ago, how in his master class, which I never took, teaching drivers how to do the very same thing that I'm talking about right now. Didn't nobody attack him for it. Okay. Because you can't make that money that way. 
in your city, that's on you. You see, then talking about you the best at the game. I don't use the driver utility helper. No, any other apps as a crush to help me make these decisions on my own on how to make this money. I'd improved it time after time after time. Again, it's not bragging. All right, you don't want other drivers in your market to find out this information because then you will have competition. Then you have to earn your keeps. You see what I'm saying? That's why y'all knocking so hard against the ratings. That's why. I, I done proved, I done proved time after time after time again. Diamond orders after diamond orders, large orders, piece of program orders, shopping delivery. How you can use these multiple programs. Making better decisions for better opportunities to maximize your earnings and make a profit. They're talking about, well, well, there ain't nothing but a couple of uh, content creators that, that went to the government, legislators, and all of this fighting for the driver rights. So I address the situation on teaching drivers how to bring back the best business etiquette and quality customer service for your repeated clients that will continue on giving you repeated tips it may not be the same amount that it was last week it may not be the same amount that it was this morning but they still tip the key to it is to have them keep tipping for a service that gives them quality customer service drivers that care about what they do and give their professional quality customer service with the best business practice people I'm showing you how I do it. He can't be getting cash tips like that. Then I start showing that live. He can't be making money like that. Then I start showing that live. They keep trying to find something negative to say about something that's positive. That's not going to stop the door to ass revolution. And you guys can quit trying to ambush me because I'm not falling for any of your tricks. So, ladies and gentlemen, I will continue on helping drivers with my how-to informational videos from 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. or 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. from Monday through Friday. Take it to the streets. Live morning show. I'm going to come back doing regular videos. I'm also going to do shorts. You're going to see me interact with merchants, which are my clients customers which are my clients with the best business practice best business etiquette quality customer service with professionalism and I'm going to keep collecting I done help drivers and I'm going to start showing their proof they gave me permission to do it so I'm not the only driver that's being successful with the diamond program. That's being successful with the piece of program. That's being successful with the large order program. And know how to utilize these multiple programs to maximize my earnings and make a profit. Peace, take care, and I'll see you in the next videos.